Well, just hours ago, the head of the state's tourism agency spoke for the first time about a controversial decision to remove a web page on LGBTQ travel from the Visit Florida website. She was in Tampa for a tourism conference. And tonight, 10 Tampa Bay's Chris Hurst tried to get to the bottom of who made that decision and why. You don't have any further comment as to I why don't. or how the page I, was I explained removed. that. My statement was super clear, so you can use explain, that. It didn't explain how or why it was you taken down. You can use down. that as my quote. Visit Florida President and CEO Dana Young didn't want to dive deeper into why the state removed a web page dedicated to LGBTQ travel. My husband had surgery this morning, so I have got to go home and check on him. I know. And um, thank you for being here. Wh whose idea was it meeting. to take it down? Yeah. The statement she gave earlier at a Visit Florida board meeting came after public comments that were critical of the move. Visit Florida, our marketing strategy and our materials, our content must align with the state. Marianne Ferentz is a former Visit Florida board chair. If we're talking about the number one industry, what's the reason? Why would we do this? It's, if this is an economic decision, I can't see how it's a good one. Governor DeSantis chimed in as the meeting was happening one county over. We're open to all, but we're not going to be segregating people by these different characteristics. That's not how we've done business in any of the things that we've done. That despite dedicated travel pages still up for African-American and Hispanic travelers. For the Bay Area travel blogger who first noticed the page was deleted, Rachel Cavello says the state is missing out on even more tourism money. We are just hardworking people and we like to spend money and we like to travel. Um, the LGBTQ demographic brings in, my guess would be about a billion or more, billion, you know, it's a billion dollar industry, tourism industry. In Tampa, Chris Hurst, 10 Tampa Bay. Cavello started a change.org petition to add LGBTQ travel back page uh, to the Visit Florida website. She also wants a Visit Florida LGBTQ travel advisory board.